Hello angels and welcome back to my channel. Hello everyone. Listen, this is mum life to a T, right? I've literally been sat like this for 10 minutes because Herbie, I, we've been in a really big meeting this morning. It was like three hours long and Herbie didn't get any cuddles. He was shook. He was so upset. He literally said, mum, what has my life come to? So we're having to spend um, time when I actually should be driving and going to my eyebrow appointment I'm laying on the floor hello angels how are we all i've missed you guys so much we go to turkey in two days boo two freaking days listen who's ready for a vlog honey because i am listen i know i don't look like it my whole life i feel like i look like how i represent my whole entire life right now like i just look a mess do you know what i mean i sprayed my face with this like tanning water last night and I think I am doing it wrong because my eyebrows and my hairline go so orange. It's actually a joke and it's kind of embarrassing. Today is Wednesday. Um, we fly to Turkey at 7.30 a.m. on Friday morning. And I literally feel like I have not got my life together in any way, shape or form, ready to go on holiday. The only thing that you could probably tell that we are going on holiday is by looking around me. And I actually don't know if I really want to show you guys. Sorry if Herbie's snoring, it's literally so loud. Yeah, it's just a giant mess. Look, this is how your life looks when you're going on holiday and you don't know what outfits to pack and you're just getting a bit upset, you know. Oh my God, why is my dog so cute? I literally can't concentrate for the life of me right now. So I thought today we could do a really fun, like, prep for holiday, pack with me vlog. Um, I know when I went to Lanzarote in April, you guys really, really loved those videos. I was just gonna say the names out again, but there's really no point because I literally just said it. I feel like this one's gonna be a little bit more relaxed than the ones I did back then because, honey, listen, to be completely honest, I don't really, like, have time to do like really really good videos right now so we're always having to do with the vlog i'm literally gonna be so mean and have to take him off my lap i'm sorry i have an eyebrow appointment because look at these it's ridiculous which i'm actually running late to so hi my name's ellie darby what's yours and that is our first stop of prepping for holiday turkey 2k19 this is my outfit for today i'm just running some errands sometimes i feel like guilty for being so basic but then other times i'm literally like you do you be, do you know what I mean? So my best friend Emily has actually just opened up her brand new salon, Gloss Bar Salon, which if you guys are in the local area, you should totally go and visit because it's incredible. She has a whole range of services, but yeah, like I said, I'm getting my brows done there today. Does anybody else just like have to check around the whole entire house to make sure that they haven't forgotten anything? Cause that's me. Hey boo. Hey darling Welcome angel. to prep. Prep with well, welcome to prep with us and pack with us on holiday. Oh, us or you? Can, you? Well, you can be involved if you want. Come. Oh, I'll bring the angels along. Thank, Thank you, Herbie. Herbie. Yeah, what have you got to do to prep and pack um, for our holiday time? I have got to. I'm just on my way to a salon called Glossy Bar. I need to get my oh, eyebrows no, threaded. Glossy Bar. What's it called? Gloss Bar. That's what I said. Um, I need to go to the gym. <laughs> Ellie, this is my segment in the video. Thank you. Sorry. I don't really do much, to be honest. I need to pack. Okay, cool. And that's it. You know what? That's great. Mm. That's great. Thanks for the update. I need to do a little uh, shop as well later. Again, I literally just showed all the angels oh. our packages upstairs because we just. Well, all right. <laughs> I have again. so many. Right, love you so much. Love have a much. fun hour without me. And you too, Herbie. Look after your dad, okay? You're Herbie. He can't can come to Gloss you. Sparkle. Yes, he what? He's allowed. Go on, Love you guys. Oh, Love you guys yeah. too. Welcome back to the. <sighs> what? Got me in my car of an eye. Oh you. my. Go on, Con. Get the Tuesday swag out. <laughs> it's Wednesday. Oh, wait, it's Wednesday. <laughs> that literally Wednesday. shows how behind ah. my life I am. Who is this that I've got standing in my hallway? This is not okay? Can't handle it. Connor shaved... Well, actually, do you want to tell the full story, Con? Last night, Connor got me to shave one of his legs. Wax. With the wax in oh, yeah, the wax. video. Oh, yeah, wax. He did this leg, probably from there to there. Too much pain for Connor Swift. It hurts you much. So he's taken it upon himself to shave his entire body this morning. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> 
Look at how smooth I am, Angel. You are very smooth. Connor, no, you don't invite the angels to touch no, your they body. Can't. The angels are allowed. Connor. They're allowed to touch my shoulder. Just. No. The Herbie's now the hairiest boy hairiest in the house. Hairiest boy in the house. Herbie, you're the hairiest boy. And I'll have to get my hair cut as well. Connor. We should have done a couple's holiday Do you prep. want, like, this video? We should have done that. Do you just want it to that. be all about you, though? No, we should have done a couple's holiday prep. Well, Con, we pretty much are. You, you're literally okay. showing the angels about how much you've shaved your body. Yeah, so angels. So oh, you are my God. We waxed this leg, as I said. And then I just shaved the rest. We just said That's that, literally what I just <laughs> said. <sighs> yeah. Great update, boo. That's the holiday prep. How are you feeling for Turkey Good. Con? I'm a little bit. 24 hours will be in the air. We would have finished a movie by now. Yeah, we would have. We've got to download stuff on the iPad oh, Con, actually. That. Yeah. That's holiday prep. We'll show you the movies yes, we watch Yes, we will. We'll show you videos we uh, download later on. Because it's quite vital, especially on a four hour flight. Think above two hours, you need to. Con was shocked. That Turkey is more than a two hour flight. I thought Turkey's literally over the road. No. I thought it's like Portugal, Turkey. God, oh my God. Anyway, we'll do all that later. But um, how buzzing are you for Turkey? I can't wait. I can't wait to start packing. Mm. I like leaving last minute. I've got so minute. much to do. I don't like leaving last minute. And that's like but let's hope our Zara packers come and boo. Because if they don't, my holiday outfits are ruined. Con's very nervous. You did a big order on there, didn't you? Well, you did get an email saying that it would arrive today, so but, stop but, stressing, boo. But, well, we've had, I had an email saying it'd be delivered today, but it's not actually meant to be delivered until Friday. Yeah, but... I'm just hoping... Come on, don't confuse everyone. You've had an email saying it's going to be delivered today, haven't you? Maybe. Angels. Right, I'm going, Con. I'm going. Have fun with Els. I'm going to get my lashes done. I'm actually just about to tell the angels what I'm going to have done today. By the way, here are my eyebrows. You said you like my eyebrows, didn't yeah, you? Yeah, they're really nice. Wow. It looks like I've actually worn... Hang on, let me just focus it on my face. I don't know if you can turn the camera, but because I fake tanned my face, when Come Emily... Your, yeah, like when she put the wax the stuff that. on. Do you I mean you noticed that? I noticed that, but I didn't know if it was accidental or what was going on, so I thought I'll just leave it, Connor. You're better off not saying anything. Just in, case, just in case I say the wrong thing. Yeah, so it looks like, I mean, I've tried to exfoliate around as best as I can this morning so it doesn't look as bad, but like there are big white patches around my eyebrows here. No, I don't look as bad as last night. Anyway, angels, yes, as we just discussed with Con, by the way, it's a new day. Good morning. Hello. Welcome. Had my Weetabix. I've had my protein shake. I am ready to get the day started. Oh, God, I hate you, man. Oh. I'm just about to go and get my lashes done. As you can see, they already look incredibly full. I just booked in half an hour this morning with my lady that I get my lashes done with. Because from past experiences, like, my lashes are so good. They always, always stay on. Apart from in, like, sweltering hot heat where, um, I don't even know, there's, like, moisture in the air. Yeah, I don't know. They just, like, tend to slide off a lot more. And, um... I'm just kind of like going to get a few extra lashes added. I mean, half an hour really won't get me many more lashes, but just for the security. Do you know what I mean? If you're a lash queen, you will know what I mean. And then I'm actually going to go straight to go and get my nails done. Now, angels, oh, this is one of those moments in life where I literally wish like this was real time. Actually, to be fair, Instagram stories is real time. I can ask you guys on that, but I don't know what color to get my nails done. I have been loving, now hear me out, lilac recently don't know why i'm just really a big lilac fan like i bought a few like purple clothes and stuff i know like so crazy but then lilac isn't very like summer holiday like for me corally kind of red orange is like a summer holiday kind of color but then connor completely like threw a spanner in the works when i asked him and he said it's like a white and i'm just like do you know what i mean then um i'm gonna pop into boots and get like a few last minute bits but then i can get it at the airport but then we're gonna be rushing around in the morning Okay, well, anyway, I'm running late. Um, I feel like this vlog is literally just me being like, oh my god, now I'm here. Oh my god, now I'm here. Okay, let's go and get our pamper on. <laughs> By the way, this is our new favourite song, Angels, okay? Don't check on me. It's so good. So let me show you what I can do. Because I, I don't mind. Listen, 
if I'm not the most glossiest, sparkling little angel on the turkey Bodrum Beach, I don't know who will be. Look at these glossy white nails. Uh, yeah. We are home. I have you guys set up on the flowers as you can probably see in the mirror. Oh, no, it's wonky. Okay. Looks like that isn't the hiding place after all. Super sister responsibilities. Do you know what I mean, guys? You have to have the mugs on the vids. Okay, so on the way back from getting my nails done, which took like forever. Does anybody else's nails take so long to do? I don't even know why. I went to Superdrug and Waterstones and I picked up a few bits that I'm going to show you guys now. But before we do that, listen, Honey did a little bit of Zara Cell shopping and it's only like one outfit, but I literally love it so much. So I feel like this is kind of relevant because we're going to be going through outfits in a minute. When Sally's suitcase comes into play, bless her, look at her. By the way, can we just like not look at my appearance today? Like, can you just look at the suitcase and not look at me? Because it is so hot and sweaty in this house. Um, I'm just not really coping very well with it, says the girl who's literally like flying to Turkey where it's going to be like 10 degrees even hotter. Anyway, so we're going to be going through outfits and stuff. I'm going to start packing in like 10 minutes when I've showed you guys all the new stuff that I picked up. First of all, I picked up these. Oh my god, how cute. Now listen, we all know I'm a sucker for small heels like this. These are my other ones from Zara. And I just love little heels like this. Like I cannot ever, I don't think another day will ever come in my entire life that I actually wear like tall heels. I just can't do it. Feet end up so sore. So that's the reason. And they're gold, angels. They are gold. Look at them, so glam to the fam. Um, actually, turns out, do you know what? I don't think any of this stuff was in the sale, actually. Connor was doing sale shopping. And I did normal shop shopping. They were 29 .99. I actually had to get a size 5 because they didn't have size 4 left. And they actually fit fine, so size up. Then I got these denim shorts to wear with them. I mean, obviously, I'm going to wear those sh shoes, like, with basically my all my outfits i just thought that these shorts were such a vibe i've never ordered anything denim from zara before and i am literally such a fan um i got these in a size 10 and i would actually probably fit way better into an 8 because these are really big around my waist love them just love those rips and love the bleach color and then to finish off the outfit obviously with some jewelry and like hair and makeup and like you know fenty body lava on the collarbones got this shirt in a medium to large because i wanted it to be oversized and this is 25.99 and you can't this one of those shirts that, like you can't really see unless you actually put it on but it's just a really lovely like satin shirt that i'm gonna wear open like i said with jewelry highlighter all on my chest with hoops oh my god sis you just wait if you're not following me for the instagram shots <laughs> who are you and then here are a few things that i picked up from waterstones and super drug so from waterstones i got a new book um obviously for turkey now let me just set the vibe okay by the way, for this chat, like, and pack section, you're going to need a cup of tea and biscuits. So if you haven't got them yet, like, pause the video and go and get them, boo, because this is just going to be, like, a really chilled out vlog. Like, do you know what I mean? Yeah, stop being annoying and stop drinking your tea. So I actually already have two books for this holiday. We're only going for a week, but when I read, I read. I am a book worm. I've got Michelle Obama's book, which I'm really excited to read, like, empowering woman you know other fiction book that i've already bought is actually from the same author as my favorite book ever that i read in lanzarote which is called the couple next door by shari lapina um i picked up another one of her books but i can't remember what it's called obviously i'll be showing you guys in the turkey vlogs anyway um and then when i was in waterstones i just picked up this one which is a bit more light-hearted because the one by shari lapina is a thriller and this is by david nichols and this is sweet sorrow and it's one life-changing summer um, and as far as I'm aware, like, obviously I read the first couple of, uh, pages and stuff. This is just, like, a really heartwarming, fun kind of story about a 16-year-old boy who looks after his dad and he falls in love and, like, just goes through his life. So, so yeah, I picked up that and I'm going to take that on the plane with me. You guys will have to keep me accountable. Like, if you see me, like, snap away on my Instagram stories... You'll have to be like, Ali, no, read your books, come on. And then from Superdrug, I didn't really get loads, um, but I did pick up this, which I thought was really interesting. This is the Soleil by Superdrug, Shimmering um, After Sun. How cool, right? It's got aloe vera in it, and we all know... <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. Oh my God, angels, if you don't want to feel like you've gone on holiday, don't smell after sun look at that oh i wish you could oh okay you kind of can see oh my 
oh my gosh that is amazing i am obsessed and obviously would i really be any derby if i didn't buy the hawaiian tropic after sun no so i'm going to holiday tomorrow right so i'm just going to sniff away I don't have to tell you guys any more times about how much you need this product. This smells like a summer holiday in a pot. In a pot! I also picked up one of these. I already have like three of these from when I've been on trips away. But I get really concerned that they go out of date. Because they're only six months once you open the mm, lid. So I bought a new one. They're just really, really handy to take away. I do take my makeup off with a cleansing balm. And I always like to follow on with that with a cotton pad afterwards. Also picked up this now angels don't judge me i'm trying something new okay and you're all probably gonna crucify me in the comments because you'll be like ellie there's this really easy method that you didn't have to buy the 05 boys styling gel to do the hair style that you are looking for anyway i just thought for ease this was three pounds i picked up the vo5 wet look styling gel listen i really want to practice that vibe on holiday where like I wish you could all get in my head. Like, glowy. Okay, no, no, no. Just picture this. Loads of highlight. Gloss. Fenty Beauty Body Lava. Highlight all on your body. And then wet look hair. So it's like like Kim Kardashian at the Met Gala. Was it the Met Gala? Do you know what I mean? It's like slicked back. But it looks like really nice and like kind of wavy. And like, oh, yeah, sorry, just got out of the shower kind of thing. Do you know what I mean? So I'm going to give that one a try and let you guys know how I get on. Yeah. So now I'm gonna start packing. I do have like a really thorough, good actually, if I do say so myself, pack with me video, which I did for Lanzarote, which was back in April. So only a few months old. I'm using all the same stuff um, where I have links and everything to all of the bags that I use and bits like that. But my suitcase is from, um, it's the DKMY one, it's from TK Max. And I also have the hand luggage option. But I think. For this trip, I'm going to be using my Louis Vuitton bag one just because, first of all, it's my Louis Vuitton. Do you know what I mean? I love it. Then also because it's like a lot easier just to open the bag rather than laying it down, zipping it open, you know, and it's hand luggage. And then um, I only started doing this within the last few months when I started to travel a lot. But I picked up, first of all, a traveling makeup bag. If you don't have a traveling makeup bag, honey, you need one. This is only from Amazon. I literally love it. It's so useful put all of my different makeup in these compartments and then I just put the makeup brushes up here and I always put like my medication or tablets or anything like that in this pocket here so it's really useful I also bought these um this is because I saw these bags on I think it was Desi Perkins pack with me and they are so useful like honestly I cannot explain to you so that just these little bags here Again, from Amazon, like super cheap. You can buy whatever sizes and stuff you want. You put your clothes in them or like whatever you choose. So say for example, the big one will probably be for my shoes. Um, just because I don't want like dirt or sand or anything off the bottom of my sandals to go on my nice dresses or shirts or kimonos or anything. They just make your suitcase like so much more tidy and organized. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, that's everything that I use. That's my toolkit. If you want to pack like Kelly Darby, okay, pack like a queen. That's what you need. Okay, Sally suitcase. Come on, Angel. You're ready to get battered once again. Poor girl. Look at her. She was brand new. What was she brand new for? I think it was actually Lanzarote, you know. She was brand new and she's literally... She's had it already. This is why it's not worth buying an expensive suitcase, you know, because they're put through the walls, poor things. Okay, let's um ignore how messy this corner actually is and that the curtain is hung up on the rail. Um, okay, so welcome to Ellie's closet. This is where I keep all my nice clothes. I was so lucky to be gifted lots and lots of lovely bits from Opoly um last week and i'm going to be taking a lot of their stuff on holiday with me so i'm going to show you the dresses now listen i can't i just can't keep this one a secret like this is my favorite and it's coming out first if you want to see these on me then um follow my instagram honey do you know what i mean and also of course i'm going to be vlogging every single day when we're in turkey anyway so i'm sure you'll see them in the vlogs yeah i just love that one maybe i can do the wet look hair with that outfit you know because that is so gorgeous then here are a few more so here we have the co-ord the like corally peachy kind of color co-ord so so nice love that but then i also love this dress like this gold dress is just something else because i'm taking that gold dress i'll probably leave this one here and wear that on a nice night out somewhere um, i also have this pink one which is so gorgeous and again so flattering very me i'm gonna take the pink one because that'll be a lovely outfit for dinner you guys know 
knowing me, you know I have to take a white dress on holiday with me because I love those angelic vibes. I'm going to take this one. I literally love that so much. It's like got a corset detail on it. I don't feel as though you can see it when I just hang it up like that but yeah it's so gorgeous that's already four outfits and we're there for a week so i need six evening outfits i think for number five i'm going to take this cold from topshop because i haven't had a chance to wear it yet and i'm obsessed with it oh look this one goes on my nails oh i'm obsessed oh so yeah, this is shorts and a blazer. This is from Topshop. So, so gorgeous. Um, I also have a little bralette that I'm going to wear with that underneath the blazer. And then I think outfit number six, which is going to be the final night look, we're going to go for the denim shorts from Zara and the shirt vibe because that is so lovely. I'm starting to feel as though this is a really awkward angle. Is this like an ugly angle? <sighs> Okay, we've switched things up, angels. We're now out in the open. Moving on to daytime outfits. Obviously, this is going to be like an all-inclusive holiday, so we aren't really planning on leaving the resort much. Um, but we do want to take a trip to the markets. For the fakes, if you know what I mean. So I'm going to take one or two daytime outfits. I'm going to take one of my ASOS white summer dresses, which I really don't need to show you guys because I wear them every single other video wash them so they're hanging outside drying but um the other daytime outfit that i'm going to take is this really cute cold from misguided a lemony yellow kind of color it's shorts and a crop top um, and that's it for daytime outfits and then other than that i'm going to take a couple of kimonos i feel like kimonos are just bae do you know what i mean like you can't go abroad outside of the uk without a kimono i'm taking this pink one which is from asos you guys will have seen this one before because i wore it a lot um in Lanzarote and then I'm taking this white lacy frilly one from Misguided which is so beautiful. So taking this play suit I know this obviously isn't a kimono but it will do like the same sort of thing you just put it on over a bikini this is from ASOS honestly ASOS are like the best for summer bits and pieces they are just so great yeah really really cute play suit like that it's got a little tie waist around there it's just gonna be something easy to like put on for breakfast and then oh my goodness like save the best till last Ellie. instead of taking one of my other kimonos I'm gonna take this this is brand Brand new from misguided and i am literally so obsessed it's a dress i feel like you can't really see it here but you guys can get the vibe right like oh my goodness it is so beautiful so flowy gorgeous so yeah you guys will definitely have to um keep up with pics of me and that keeping up with the kardashians mm, what else have i got ready okay here are my shoes put them all in this bag just like i said i would because i'm true to my word i'm taking the white pair of zara heels and the gold pair of zara heels and then the other pair of heels i'm taking are these ones so these are from Topshop. they are gorgeous these were in the sale if you guys have watched my come shopping with me summer 2019 you would have seen these in this vlog i thought these would go perfectly with this like peach color cord from my poly so lovely um i'm not really taking many other shoes to be fair i've got this pair of sandals in case i want to wear these instead of heels one night um because they're really like stunning and i'm also taking these flip-flops in case i feel like wearing flip-flops one night because they're like a bit glitz and glam they look really like dirty and gross but actually they're still cute hashtag primark and other than that i'm literally just taking these two pairs of flip-flops which are from asos these are the square toe ones if you guys don't know about these you need to get them they're five pounds each they do them in blue as well i have every color but i don't really have any like oh no i am taking a blue bikini <gasps> maybe i should take the blue flip-flops they are just a vibe do you know what I mean? There's something different about a square toe. They just make them like a bit more luxe. Just love them. Um, that's the only daytime bag I'm taking. And then I'm taking three evening bags. I'm taking this one, which is from ASOS. This is the one that I've been wearing to a lot of the weddings that I've been going to over the summer. And I'm just obsessed with it. I literally think that is so gorgeous. Then I'm also taking this one, which I got a few months back from Zara. Actually, I bought this a while ago this was back in april i think i love this one so much it's just very beach babe-esque you know and then i'm taking my gucci bag with me as well and here we have my little bag full of accessories so this is hair scrunchies earrings hair bands tweezers rings any sort of little bit and bob like that that will get lost in any other bag so i've got a big bag for it here we have my skincare so i've got a bag full of cotton pads and then um i have all of my keels bits and bobs in here in here i've got all my serums my lip balms a face mask a hydration face mask for after the plane eye cream uh moisturizers I, the moisturizer i use is this one and it literally never fails me although i'm running out so i'm probably gonna have to get a new one um, in this bag this is the toiletry bag so obviously all the essentials here are the swimming courses that i'm taking so i'm actually going to roll them all up and put them in this little bag here first one is actually brand new from asos and i am obsessed with it like angels this gives me 
Kim Kardashian vibes. Like, you know when she went through that, like, you know when she first started with the whole Yeezy vibe? That is what this bikini really, like, does for me. It's a really lovely, like, blue-gray kind of colour. I think that's kind of... Hello! Like, who comes in the door and says Guten Tag? Guten Tag. Hola. So yeah, here is the top. It's like a high neck top and then the bottoms are just something else. They are literally so flattering. Uh, super high waisted. So nice. Another one from ASOS that you guys would have actually seen in the ASOS outfit challenge that me and Connor did a couple of videos back. It's the shiny pink metallic one. I ordered the top, everybody. If you've watched the video, you'll know. This is what the top looks like. I think I got a size 12 in the top because, yeah, I did. It, that just looks really, like, tiny, do you know? So, I'm glad I got a size 12. Obviously, I'm going to be taking my Meshki pink swimsuit. This is the most flattering swimming costume I have ever worn in my entire life. It is so nice and it's such high quality. Also taking this bikini, which is from Misguided. The bottoms are so gorgeous as well. They look like this with the little beads on the side. So cute. I think everyone just needs like a standard white bikini though. Do you know what I mean? Um, what else? What else? Yellow one from ASOS, which is lovely. Again, so flattering. Any tips of mine for like a big hipped kind of girl that wants to feel really confident in a swimming costume? FYI, you should anyway. Like, like any swimming costume, any bikini that you wear ever, you should feel confident in because you're amazing. I know that I personally feel a lot more confident when I'm wearing high-waisted stuff or high-legged stuff. So the hips are fully out. Like nobody's putting them babies back in the swimming costume. Do you know what I mean? But if the hips are supposed to be out, then it's a lot more comfortable than wearing like a low-rise bikini. Oh my god, I literally cringe saying that because who even wears those? I've also got this one from Zara, which goes like that. So this shoulder is out. Really, really lovely. I haven't actually worn that yet, but I bought that ages ago obviously this white swimming costume oh my goodness this is just an absolute vibe angels this ties around the middle and it is literally again so so flattering um now listen if you're not into the neon vibes this summer you must get onto the neon vibes because i feel like this has turned into a haul it's not this is the pack with me uh, this neon swimming costume well bikini from opoly is literally so nice so i'm taking that one um i have got both the types of bottoms like you know the bikini brief and then like the thong version and i'm not sure which is like more flattering so i'm just going to take both and i hope for the best and then i'm also going to take this really gorgeous blue bikini which is from mars the label i literally love that so much i love her stuff and she's such a nice girl and the bottoms are just insane the tie bits are really really long so they look extra luxe but yeah this is really high quality and really nice hello herbie come here darling you plainly can't get past because of the suitcase. Look at that face of thought. Come here. You sniffing all the stuff, making sure I've got the right bits. Let me give the angels a big kiss. That's everything pretty much um obviously pajamas and underwear as well but then just sunglasses i'm taking a few but these are my favorite because they're brand new i bought them from i think i bought them from misguided because they were on sale for like 18 pounds how cute are they i literally love them so much and they look so nice on they're gonna be my go-to but then i obviously just have my standard ray bands which are like just black aviators um and then i have round ones in there and then obviously i'm gonna pack my makeup i'm not gonna show you what makeup i'm packing because it's literally the same thing as like every other um, makeup routine or tutorial that I have done and I've done a couple of them recently so I'm just gonna show you my absolute must-haves obviously this now listen angels we're all in luck because Fenty Beauty is docking boots now so um yeah we all need to get on that I have every color in the Fenty Beauty body lava this is who needs clothes I was after this shade for ages but it was sold out everywhere until it came into boots yeah this one is the one I'm taking with me I will use this every single night along with my highlighter um and then obviously I'm gonna be taking my iconic um prep set glow this is my little travel size spray i do have a full size spray as well but this is obviously what i take away um kylie cosmetics actually i was just thinking about what other stuff i'm going to be taking that i often get questions on um i bought like a huge order from kylie cosmetics a couple of months ago when she released her kybrow and it was the first time i'd ever tried kylie cosmetics so i like kind of went all out because shipping is expensive and so is the import tax you have to pay when it arrives so i bought a few lip kits from there and i'm obsessed with them like I would happily make another order on that with the shipping cost and with the import tax because it's just such nice stuff. Um, the pink shade that I wear a lot is LA and then I wear that with the high glosses as well. Um, and that's it really, like, that's the most one that I've used. But then I also got a red shade as well. So that is really nice. I think that's called like Boss Girl or something. 
boss maybe i don't know if i wear them i will let you know which ones i'm wearing because they are amazing i really recommend the high glosses because they're so nice look who's come to ruin our packing party herb oh here he comes chomping away what are you eating no you don't say that to the angels what are you eating me and herbie are waiting for your answer a biscuit crisps can't get these out of biscuit or crisps protein bar mm. honey proud of me of packing i'm all done now shut up yeah you're fully packed yeah <laughs> why are you wagging your towel at the same time as crying but yeah just packing um my hand luggage at the moment con but yeah all the are suitcase is ready to go yeah did you wake your bag yet? No. Oh. Got our passports in here. Herbie, you don't lick the Louis Vuitton. Oh, okay, you can kiss the angels all you want. Oh, that's so kind. <laughs> Good boy. Herbie, what's this? Stay. What's this? Stay. Yeah, I'm gonna take my, my horse to the... the... Oh, are you popping along? Sit down. Look, sit down. Sit. Good boy. Wow! Oh. You're good at that, Harvey! Look, catch it on your head. Hey. Hey. Good Love is in the air tonight. I am yours, so hold me tight. Love is in the air tonight. You're going to stay at Connor's mum and dad's, aren't you? Nan and Gramps. Here are our suitcases all ready to go. Connor is actually um, about to go to Tesco's and get our Turkish lira. The angels want to come holiday. with me. Boo, they can't come with you. Mm. I've got to stay here and edit the video for it to actually get up because this has been like a in the... I can't remember what to say like real-time video um, Because obviously this has been filmed the day before going on holiday and we're going on holiday tomorrow And you like you're in the same time zone as me. Do you know what I mean? You're not in the future So I'm actually gonna go ahead and finish the video here angels because yeah, I need to edit it um, By the way, these are bomb like why have I not had these before? I don't know. They're so good a 2 spritz apple and watermelon get in me the next video is gonna be uploaded on Sunday which is gonna be a travel to turkey with us obviously airport vlog your favorites i actually feel like the next week is going to be one of your guys favorites in terms of content because it's just going to be holiday vlogs and i know you guys love them so so much so if you have any specific content that you want me to upload when i'm away or like a get ready with me or anything like that then do let me know in the comments below and i will make sure i can try my best to do it but i'm kind of going to try really hard to just have a nice like relaxing holiday um that's actually the reason why we booked it was to like <laughs> have a relax like a relaxing time off of work and not actually film or like just do any content whatsoever but i feel really weird like going away and not bringing you guys along with me so but yeah at the same time we're going to try and relax as much as we can con's off see you later con do you want to say say you're out out ski i'm out here oh okay love you goodbye love you angels so much thank you so much for watching hope you guys are excited for the holiday vlogs Woo! and we will see you in on turkey. sunday in turkey at the airport actually we'll see you at 3 a.m in the morning because that's the time i have to get up see you in six hours Buzzing. love you bye love